All right, so just to kind of start off, what kind of stuff do you get out of camp today and, and whatnot? How come you wanted to be part of this? Uh, there was a lot of stuff that I got from the camp today. Uh, hanging around all the players and stuff and the coaches, it's just good to know how they work, how they operate and stuff, like their mentality, going through drills and uh, playing. It's, it's really good. Right, right. Now, you got a chance to do a little unofficial visit thing before this, right? Yep, I did it last night. Okay. How did, how did that go for you? What kind of stuff did you take from it and what kind of stuff did you see and like and... Uh, Whatever else. Well, what I liked, I think the whole campus is super cool. I went around with Coach Lutz, Coach Shrewsbury, okay. and Coach Brantley. And they're all, I think they're really good coaches. They're super nice guys, so it was super fun to see the campus. And my dad went to Purdue as well, yeah. so it was super fun for him to see the campus again, and it, I liked it a lot. Yeah, just this being where a large part of your family kind of originated from, is that was that especially significant for you too to, to kind of see the town? Yeah, I well. mean, I've been here one other time three years ago. Right. It wasn't on a visit or anything. And because my dad's whole family grew up here, it's just super cool to see what he grew up in, where he went to school. Right. And I think I'm super interested in this because of my dad and his relationship with it. Right. So what was kind of Purdue's message to you? What did they want to really accentuate about themselves and what kind of stuff did they want to just kind of get across to you? Well, they just kind of wanted to like share their interests and stuff with me and like how much they're interested in me and just kind of like making it feel like a home, like a family here. Right. And just kind of like the Purdue, like all the pride stuff. And so it was really good. Yeah. So how, how come they are so interested in you? What did they tell you in terms of what they like most about you that, you know, they're so interested? Uh, well, what they like is what Coach Painter told me is uh, they really like, like obviously my ability to score and then they yeah. like guys that low assist low alert low turnovers right right and like high assists so that's kind of like the main things that they've been talking to me and they just they just like uh, the way i play right the few times i've seen you play you seem like a good kind of basketball iq type of guy mm -hmm. that's that's also been another thing where did that kind of come from though how did you get to become that sort of cerebral well, I've sort of guy. Just, just watched a lot of basketball in my life. Like, right. I grew up watching a bunch of highlight videos, a bunch of YouTube, watching a lot of NBA games and college games. Right. And I've been around high school basketball for a while because I got a really close re relationship with our high school coach when I was young. Right. So I've been to a lot of games and just like watching how different guys play and what different guys can do and just kind of trying to implement that in my game. Right, right. I know you got all the time in the world here, but do you have any sort of sense yet as to where Purdue might kind of fit into things for you here from a recruiting perspective? I'd for sure say that they're going to be pretty high on my list just because starting off with the relationship that my dad has here yeah. that's obviously big and I've been Purdue fan my whole life and now right. being able to go on unofficial visits and seeing the campus and talking to the coaches more I think it will for sure be an option. Right. I mean again I temper everything with you've got all the time in the world here but do you have a plan of attack for recruiting do you have any sort of plan in terms of how you want to do this how long you want to go or Not anything yet. like that I, I mean I have no idea just, yeah I'll right. kind of know when it's when it's the right decision in the right school. Right, right. So kind of run me through things here. Purdue's offered you Iowa, Wisconsin. Uh, in Minnesota. Right, in Minnesota. Mm -hmm. Who else is, are you hearing from? Uh, I've heard from Stanford, Stanford and Xavier. This has to be pretty, pretty exciting. I mean, is your, your head spinning at all that all this has happened for you so quickly, or were you pretty even keeled about it? Uh, a little bit. I'd just say it's more kind of humbling to me, just because right. it's like when you get an offer, you just kind of want to work harder. Right. Because it's obviously, it's obviously one of those things where when you get it, a lot of people can either like take their foot off the gas and not work as hard right. and just say, oh, well, I have a couple offers. But I for sure try to take into account that like to be able to play at this level, I have to put in the work. So after right. getting those offers, it's been like a good experience and a good teaching lesson for me to know that I have to right. work Right, right. You also got the USA basketball opportunity. I mean, it seems like, you know, a lot of stuff's happening for you right, right now too. Did you sort of see this coming or has this all kind of taken you by surprise a little bit? Uh, a little bit of both. A little bit of both. I think with the USA basketball is a little bit surprising, but right. I think that experience is amazing because everybody there is just like a top-notch player. And it's just kind of like you have to play your hardest and be your best all the time. Right, right. Um, what do you expect to be long term? Will you be a wing? Will you be a yeah, that I'd, sort of stretch four with, with a guard even? With yeah, I'd say like guard wing is what uh, I always expect to be in long term. Right. Are there any players you molded yourself after you've admired that you always try to, I guess, shape your game? I've actually watched a lot of Devin Booker. I think <laughs> like the way he plays, I like it a lot. His ability to score, I think we both have that in common. A little right. bit of Tyler Hero as he's coming into the <laughs> NBA now. I watched him a lot in high school and uh, in college. Gotcha.